Hello everyone and welcome to the Lenovo F1 in Schools National Finals here at Leeds University. I am your unofficial Martin Brundle for today and I'll be doing the pit walk through all the teams. So we're going to start with the development class. At first we've got Team Vortex. Wow, this pit is incredible. Do you want to tell me what you think is the most important part about your pit display? Um, I think our journey is one of the best parts. It just shows all the progress we've made through the competition and how we've gotten to where we are now. And you guys have been the first here every single day, I've noticed, and this morning we had the proclaimers blasting around. So you've got quite a lot of sponsors, we can just see them there. Do you want to tell me a little bit about them? Um, yeah, Lamborghini Edinburgh really have been one of our biggest sponsors. We're really grateful to Andy Canning for helping us with all of our projects and, and the Proclaimers and Lead Ad Agency as well have been really, really great. And lots of Iron Brew to keep you all ready. Well, you guys have done an absolutely amazing job this time. So you've got lots, lots of um, first class trophies there. So yep. very successful team and happy to see how you guys do. Yeah, um, we're really excited. Hopefully it goes well. Well, I've got to go on to the next team. So well done, guys, and I'll see you guys soon. Cheers. So hello, here we have Pocket Rocket. Amazing guys. So do you want to tell me something important about your pit display? Um, it, it took long, a long time to get um, the, the back boards and it fell. So we had to um, come up with that to keep it up. I mean, I absolutely love these little freebies that you guys have got given out. So phone holders. So who came up with that idea? Um, it, I came up with the phone holders and then George came up with the um, rulers and Harris came up with the, the keychains. And lots of really fun things. A little freebie. I might, I might just take, I'm going to take one. Um, these portfolios are also looking amazing. All the engineering drawings on the side. So um, do you think it, this has gone well so far? Have you done, done a, happy with how you've done? I think, I think we, could, we can come back stronger. But yeah, I'm glad what we've done. It's good. I say it looks absolutely amazing. So I've, I've got ahead, so I'm just going to nip over to the next team. Thanks, guys. Thanks for showing me around. Hello, Hammerhead Racing. Absolutely amazing energy on the track yesterday. So do you want to tell me something about your pit display? Uh, so we've worked very hard to create this pit display. Um, we've ordered lots of uh, different materials to help make it look as good as it can. And you've got that, that screen there with all the sim scale testing. Whose idea was that? Uh, so that was Ayan, he, he does our CFD for the team. Uh, oh, it's gone to the next slide, but uh, yeah, you can really, it really allows us to visualize uh, the car uh, and what it will be like on the track. And I absolutely love that little reflection you've got in the background. So something to do with the hammerhead, the shark, the water. Absolutely love it. And you've got all the, all the team pictures up here. Um, oh, and also the, the, origami, the origami sharks, everyone can have one of them. Whose idea was that? Uh, that was mine. So uh, we created these templates. Um, and if you cut this out and fold it, then you can end up with one of these. Absolutely amazing, emanating the primary class. Thanks for showing me around, guys. Um, and I'll see you guys on track soon. Oh, here we have Exhausted Racing, one of the most, the best brand identities that I've seen. So do you want to tell me something about your pit display? Well, where, where to start? We've got, we've got the events and scalability on the enterprise side. With these three, we've got the engineering side, all the iterations of our car, our magical floating platform if you if you bring it down a bit you'll see nothing underneath and we have the of course the glasses which are the the main part of our brand identity you've got our website social media our presentation i love it giving our cameraman directions there so you can see this this pit display you can see from a mile off so you guys have done such a good job how did you feel yesterday went yeah, pretty pretty well. We're, we're pleased with how it went and we're trying to build on that for today with some racing and we hope it goes well. And i got to say, I don't understand what's going on here. So do you want to tell me a little bit about why you've got the, the actual car car parts here? Yeah, so they're, they're one of our sponsors, Signature Group, a car detailing firm, and they kindly gave us some things to give away and, and show everyone. There we go. So free advertisement for Signature Group there. I'm going to go on to the next team. Thank you, everyone. Well done. And next we have our first Welsh team, Airborne. Hi girls, how are you doing? I'm good, thank you. Hi. Is there anything special you want to tell me about this pit display? It looks absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, so we've got competition. Um, we've got a petition that we're trying to get a lot of people to sign. We're aiming to get 100 signatures um, and everyone gets a free octopus if they do that. What is the petition for? Uh, to stop the Willow project. Oh, that's interesting. Do you want to tell me more about that? Um, yeah, so it's a project um, in Antarctica and it could cause the whole of Antarctica to melt, which we do not want to happen. Um, so if we get like a million, like if the whole like petition gets a million uh, signatures, then it could stop. So really doing our bit to help out the environment here. I love it. So do you want to tell me a little bit more about this, this little octopus that we have? I know I've got one. I've got one over on the TV there. Um, so it was given to us by um, one of our sponsors, Octopus Energy, along with big octopuses and 
the um, books. Green energy and going sustainable green. Absolutely amazing. I love the work done here. Amazing pit display, very eye catching. Great job, girls. Next, we're going to have Red Eagle Racing. How are we all doing? Good, thank you. Yes. I mean, this pit display looks look, looks amazing. So many um, things on the wall. Do you want to tell me a little bit a little bit about it? How you came up with the ideas? Um, well, it's it's the the colours are really inspired by our school logo. Um, Cause our school logo is the full eagle here, um, but we just cut it and put our name on it. Um, and obviously, the colours are the same as our logo, red and black. So yeah. Absolutely love this revolving car. If we can just get our cameraman to come and have a look at this. Who came up with that idea? Um, we yeah, we thought. Um, some of the at the regionals, our pit display wasn't very interactive. Didn't really quite show off what we had with the car. And um, a turntable is quite a commonly used device to um, make the best use. I love it. It looks absolutely amazing. And also all the the sim drawings you've got on here. Simulation of the car, uh, just showing how the airflow interacts with everything. Got lots of different options with the front wing, the overhang, and yeah. We have also got just an exploded view of the car, just showing the key elements of everything and yeah amazing can never get these guys to stop talking good job i love the pit display so next we have samurai racing lots of information on this pit display do you want to tell me what you think is the best part about it um, the connect step which generates power for the leds and also the solar panel as it's renewable and it recycles and it can be recycled and put into different places that is absolutely amazing so you've got people standing on that all day to power your pit display yeah it looks absolutely amazing. So, oh, I've got a gift. I've got, I've got a pair of socks. Absolutely love these. I think Max will be happy I've got them, sneaky feet. Um, do you want to tell me a little bit about your partners that you've got on the wall here? Uh, Matisse. Um, we've got our, firstly, Anglo-American, which are our title partner, which basically financially, they helped us everything. We couldn't have done this without them. And also we've got Harley Quinn, who made these amazing team uniforms for us. Blue Aptor, who helped with designing and of course making this recyclable totem. And then, of course, we've got 3D Print UK, Keyshot, and then Mind as well, where we are currently collecting money. For Absolutely amazing. So doing things for charity in this, in this world fi national finals. So great job, guys. Absolutely amazing. And I'll see you guys soon on track. So up next, we have the Rocket Raptors, another Welsh team. How are you guys doing? Doing all right. Pretty tired, but yeah. Can't be tired. It's first first morning of the day. So do you want to tell me a little bit about your pit display? Tell me something impressive about it. Uh, we've got a lot of information on display and we've got all of our cars up here as well. Oh, you want a free mug? Oh, and I get a free, free mug and socks today. I absolutely love the Welsh flag, so is there a lot of Welsh pride in this team? Definitely. Oh, the one that doesn't like to chit chat. I'm going to go over to the other side of the fit display. Um, these bottles, absolutely love them. Are they going free? Yeah. Will I get one? Maybe. Oh, maybe I'll have to work hard for that one. <laughs> so what's on the TV here? What's, what's it showing? Uh, the car's been manufactured in our CMC machine back on the college site. Absolutely amazing. Lots of information on display this team. Well done for yesterday, guys, and I'll see you later on the track. Hello, HROC. How are we doing? This pit display looks amazing. I've seen this. Um, some, I've heard some information about it. Do you want to tell me something? Yeah, you will too. Oh, so this is our pit display. This is all our merchandise over here. And that's our car itself. And yes, this is our pit display. It's all sustainable. Everything over here is sustainable. So I want to know a little bit more about these bamboo, the bamboo. What's what's going on here? Why did you choose to have a, an open pit display? Um, we focus more on sustainability this year. So because uh, this is our first year in the competition. So we only get four marks on sustainability. So and bamboos are sustainable. There we go. So making a making a goal and sticking to it. So the, the, it looks absolutely amazing. Where is the car in this in this render? It's a generic um, location um, from the re uh, rendering tool we used. Maybe Silverstone next year? Possibly, yeah. Okay, okay so I'm just going to go to the next team. Thanks for having me, guys. So, hello, Celerity. How are you doing? Very good, very good, very good. Do you want to tell me something interesting about your pit display? I can see you've got a reaction trainer there. Yes, we've got a reaction trainer here. That We've got the tables. They're made from woods. These were originally used from a different team last time, and then we're reusing them to help stay sustainable. And is that your um, your your journey through the competition, so your progression from regionals? Yeah. Um, yeah. The first car there um, was actually our car from last year in entry class. And then the second car is from regionals, the third is another design, and the fourth is a replica of our final design that we ended up racing here. Absolutely amazing. I love seeing the evolution. I'm just going to jump in here to have a little look. Look at this. Two, 
this two-tone design, I absolutely love it. Really makes it stand out on track. Um, all the free mugs, free merchandise, have you got rid of a lot of that? Yeah, we've gotten rid of a lot of key rings. We had um, phone holders before, but we're completely out of those. Uh, and we only have two mugs left now. There we go, so come early if you want your celebrity mugs. Thanks for having me, guys. I'm going to jump to the next team. Hello, Neutron Racing from Connors Key High School. How are you feeling? Good, thank you. And is there anything you want to tell me about your pit display? I can see you've got some cupcakes there, a nice teddy. Yeah. Um, not, not particularly, but yeah, we've tried hard doing our pit display, so yeah. I mean, I think it looks amazing. You've got so many sponsors here. Is there anything you want to say? A thank you to your sponsors? Uh, yeah, um, just thank you very much for sponsoring us, and we're happy to work with you. It looks absolutely amazing. So do you want to tell me a little bit about these, these um, the cardboard cars you've got going on? Who wants to talk about them? Um, so in schools, we um, in our high school, we're going to start a STEM day where we're getting uh, some year fives to come in and make their own uh, Model F1 cars out of cardboard. Amazing. So it's like the, like the primary school competition, getting them ready for that. Thanks for having me. Amazing pit display. Good luck, guys. And next, we're going to have Phantom Racing. How are you feeling? Yeah, very good, thank you. Um, so, pit display looks so professional, really good. Um, I love the checkered flag on the on the table. Do you want to tell me something you think is most impressive about it? Um, so, we actually use a lot of re like res we use a lot of resource like resources that were already used before from previous teams. So, like we added to the sustainability side of our pit display by using. All of these checkered flags and banners were used from the PCA of our school um, so that we didn't have to start buying new stuff, use more materials. And amazing, I see you've got all your social medias on there, so are you guys quite, quite, quite big? Yeah, that's our team website. We've, we're, we're not big as such, but we're getting there, I would say. I'd say it looks, it looks absolutely amazing. So you've got an exploded view of the car and you've got all of your, um, your pictures on the side there. Um, the, the car looks incredible. Were you happy with how it performed yesterday? Really happy, actually. Uh, performed well above our expectations. Amazing. I love that. You, you seem happy about it. <laughs> um, it. It was made in quite a rush because uh, one of our, our old cars is actually too heavy, so we had to remake in like three days, so we're quite happy it came fifth. So. See that. Thinking on the spot. Thank you, everyone, and I'll see you guys soon. Next, we have Flo from the Simon Langton Boys School. How are you feeling? Uh, good. Yeah. A pit display looks absolutely incredible, really professional, really clean. Who wants to talk me through that? There we go. Uh, that's kind of one of our big three principles, sustainability, professionalism, and most importantly, innovation. So we went with a very uh, trying to be innov innovative, something that people haven't really done before, um, with the centered stand, which is more of a shelf, but it's all inbuilt so we didn't we were able to transport this really easily it was all recycled so yeah and there's so much room i can jump in here and see see all your team names all what you're doing and all the cars these car reservations from previous previous yeah, so that's our current car we've got on uh, regionals car and our first draft and hoping hoping to get through to the worlds yeah i mean i think that'd be great for i think that's what we all want i mean that's what everyone well, that's what everyone wants so yeah. good luck everyone well done on yesterday thank you and next we have Bolt Racing. How are you feeling? Yeah, pretty confident, thank you. Yeah, oh, confident, I like it. So this is so there's so much going on in this pit display. Absolutely amazing. I don't know what to what to pick out first. So you tell me what's the best part? Uh, I'd personally say it's the neon sign, you know, it really draws the middle. I mean, I could see that from where I was sat yesterday on track, so it's absolutely incredible. These water bottles, what are all these um, these car, these different cars down there? So that one at the front is our regional car, which got the fastest car, best engineered car, and got us first place. And the other two were test cars, which we learned a lot from. And what is this? What is this? This track here it looks incredible. So this is our scale electric track to add a bit more um, kind of enjoyment to our actual stand. So I mean, if you would like to race. Do we have time, time to race? I'm pressing. We'll race. Okay. Oh, I'm a bit scared. Hey, I'm a winner. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave you guys. Thank you, thank you for letting me win, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Where are we going to now? Over this way. Hello, Mark Racing. How are you? All right, I'm good, thank you. And so much, so much to go on on this pit display. You tell me the most important part. It looks amazing, all professional with the photos. Um, the 
the most important part is probably the development of our cars, I see. Yeah. I mean, I spoke to you a lot, a lot yesterday, so I think I'll give you a break today. Do you want to tell me what your favourite part is? Uh, I, what in the full thing? I like looking at everybody else's bit displays and getting inspiration. You like getting ideas. Yeah. And what's it? So you, um, you did a lot. This is your from your regionals or your all your awards there? Uh, yeah, but we didn't do regionals, so that's more. I'm going to go over there. Tell me about your regionals journey. Okay, so we went originally in 2022 and we won the verbal presentation and then we went back and we won all the blue awards around the back here and these um electric cars are so addictive so thank you that distracted me and tom all day yesterday it looks absolutely amazing if there's any left i think you should give them out to people they're not too sure about that i'm gonna wrap it up thanks for having me girls it looks amazing best of luck in the competition and here we have ignite underscore nc how you doing uh, doing very well, thank you. So this pit display, absolutely amazing, stunning colours. What's going on here? Um, this is Tarmac, so um, we wanted to have something that sort of um, represented sort of a typical like garage uh, kind of racing feel. So we have Tarmac to represent some sort of road. That looks absolutely amazing. Um, what's going on here? Um, this is, it's not fully set up yet, but we had um, a flow simulation of our car um, on this display. So once the flow trajectory to be up and running, you'd be able to see the arrows for the air um, going over the car. Giving all your secrets to other teams. Um, lots of sponsors on the wall. Who wants to talk me through them? I'll jump in. Oh, uh, so we, we got a board. We got platinum, gold, silver and bronze. They're in order. So uh, most important to, you know, um, are, they just go in order. Uh, we got quite a few and we approached them on LinkedIn. I'm sure you're going to be thanking them if you get through to the World Finals. Thanks for having me. I'm going to jump over to the next team, Eloy Swift. Where am I going to go? I'm going to go over here. Um, do you want to tell me a little bit about, about your pit display? Yeah, so we have, we have a solar panel. Everything's eco-friendly, made of cardboard and recycled wood. So, yeah. So, going for the sustainability angle, looks amazing. Um, why did we go for solar power? Because uh, solar panel, it, solar, solar power is renewable and we can use it again and again. And uh, it's also the cheapest thing to put on our pit display. So we can uh, tell people about it. So budgeting and resourcefulness. Um, what's, what's going on on the, on the iPad here? Lots of technology, lots of, lots of screens? It just shows all the stuff we've been doing online. So on the iPad, there's a, in, our website which contains all the information about what we have done and all the stuff we have done to raise money. We also have a raffle. Uh, for, for the AMG caps and the purses and the key rings as well, they're all for sale and for the raffle. So you can win it tonight. Tonight, and if you buy 50p for a ticket, and you can win the. I mean, I have to. I might have to get a ticket because that cap is looking absolutely amazing. Thank you for having me. I'm going to jump over to the next team. Got to go. Come with me. And we have Tachyon. How you doing? Uh, good. Good. So this pit display looks amazing. I'm absolutely, I love this. Can you tell me a little bit about this design? So basically we've got a rotating plinth with our team name on it and also with our regionals car. So just to show off a bit of team identity, a bit of what our car actually looks like. We've got lights, you know how important lights are in something like this. Uh, just accentuating team colors, can, just building on that team identity, yeah. Yeah, it looks absolutely amazing. So we have um, some of your sponsors on the wall, I think. Who wants to tell me a little bit about them? So we have many sponsors, uh, so they've been greatly helpful in allowing us to, to assemble all of this. We've purchased a lot of these materials with their help, and uh, we're very indebted to them. Uh, and I hope we're providing a suitable return on investment. I mean, I definitely think they are. Cameraman's got a lot of shots of them, so thank you, Tachyon, and I will be seeing you soon. Well, that's that's cool, little rubbish. You didn't tell me about that, guys. <laughs> um, next, we have Inferno. How are we doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm, I'm very good, thank you. I haven't, I haven't been asked yet. Uh, so here on our pit display, firstly we have our car, Ember X, and then we have our two Enterprise uh, sides, and then on the table we have our success, so it shows uh, the trophies we've won. Then we have some light bars, which like sort of set the mood for Inferno, and then we have uh, we did a primary school workshop, and that was the winning entry over there, so we've displayed it at our national finals. And then we have some keychains, uh, one for you, and then for the cameraman. Yeah. yeah. So you made these from recycled acrylic sheets yeah. and we laser cut them and then we have our portfolios. I absolutely love that you've got all the information on the wall there about the drag the drag force. Were you happy with how the car performed? Uh, yes, yeah, so we were happy with how the car did. Yeah, it was really fun. Happy. Really happy. Car was good. We were happy with the... Time yeah. today. Oh, happy to happy, hoping to go even faster. Yeah. And there we go. They've got, the, they've got their records on the wall already. So thanks for having me, guys. Amazing pit display. Hope all goes well. And ha fingers crossed for the world finals. 
And next we have Tori Veloci just doing the last minute preparations on the pit display there. How are you feeling? Uh, we're feeling good. We're very excited. So who who took charge on the pit display? Who's pro on F I'll jump over here then. I'll go there. Right, um, so we took inspiration from F1 pit wall. Uh, so we have our four monitors. In F1, they would be typically used for viewing live telemetry and data. But here we've decided to display renders of our car, uh, as well as our sustainability statement, as well as our website. On our banners, we have more about our team and our main sponsors, as well as our car development and sustainability. So taking inspiration from F1 with the name and the pit wall, I love it. What do these QR codes show? Uh, so we used QR codes, so we didn't have to print out more detail about every single bit of the team. So uh, each one corresponds to a different page, more about our team, about our, our environmental values, or there's also an AR model of the car. Absolutely amazing, looks brilliant. I've, I'm giving the signal, so I'm going to have to go, but thanks for having me, guys. Best of luck. So where are we going off to now? We're going to D21 gear shift. Wow, look at this. Can you tell me a little bit about this centre plinth here? Um, we call it Windy 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 Mindy. Uh, it's our we, it's our homemade uh, wind machine. Little, oh, I can't even speak. <laughs> it's okay. The nerves have got to you. It's fine. So Windy Mindy over here looks amazing. So are these different car iterations? What's what's what else is on the pit display? Well, we've got our car iterations, as you said before. They've showed our journey. Then we've got the backboard that shows us as a team, our values, and what we've done so far to improve and reiterate our car design. Absolutely amazing. Looks brilliant. Um, so, you've got your proudly sponsored by Cedo. Who Is there any else you want to thank? Yeah, we'd like to thank Filtermist, who have sponsored us, and Horton Automatics. We'd also like to thank our teachers, who have helped us massively in our journey here at F1. Absolutely amazing. Pit play looks great. Best of luck for, for today for the world for results. Thank you. And we have CHS Comet. Wow. Just wow. I'm going to give a second for the cameraman to, to look at that because this is incredible. Yeah, it's quite nice, isn't it? What's, I, I don't even know what to pick out. There's so much stuff. So you tell me what your favourite part is. Uh, probably the video on the monitor because I did it. Oh, okay. What does that video on the monitor show? Um, well, it's just kind of our journey in pictures. So, yeah, it's quite representative of what we've been through from regionals to nationals. And, yeah, it's got some really nice moments in it. And I see all the are these different car iterations. Is that a toolkit that we didn't get to see yesterday? Yeah, yeah, that's the toolkit in case any repairs are needed. Um, Remind me, were there any? No, thankfully not. Yeah, it's going all right so far. <laughs> and you've got a book there about how to treat aut autistic people. What's, what's the, the idea behind that? Um, we had a meeting with a neurodivergent specialist who told us more about autism and it was just something she'd given us to spread more awareness about it around school. Absolutely love it. So making some important moves here. So thank you for having me. Looks amazing. Best of luck for results, guys. And I'm just going to take a little trip around here and we're going to go to Radion Racing. Hello, how are you doing today? We're good. So this pit display looks so professional and um, there's lots of things on it. So do you want to tell me what you think the most important part is? Well, we believe the most important part of it is definitely our car, was we explain how our car works. Um, we also have our sustainability. So we just explain how we're sustainable, how we keep it sustainable, um, how we market ourselves, or how we was to push ourselves out to other people. And then we have our evolution to how we've changed over the time from regional to nationals. Oh, so the iteration is very important in this competition. So you've done quite a lot of design changes. Have you changed the the, the pit display much? Uh, we didn't. We changed it like mostly just because we changed a lot from regionals to nationals. We did a lot more. Just try to do as much as possible. Yeah, it looks amazing. Are these all spare car parts in case things break? Uh, well, they're just like old prototypes, botched wings, things that didn't work. Amazing. It's important to show off all your hard work that you've done, even if they don't work. Um, so thanks for having me. I'm going to jump over to the next team. And best of luck. Slipstream Motorsport. Where am I going to jump in here? Wow. This looks incredible. What's what's going on here? We've got Lewis Hamilton. Yeah, so that's uh, F1 2022. So we've got a little competition running. Uh, so who can set the fastest lap time on Silverstone? And first place gets a T-shirt. Second place gets a cap. Third place gets a pen. It's a shame that they've been keeping me on track. I would have, I would have liked to have a go at this. Um, so you've got a section there on inspiring younger pupils. Do you want to, who wants to tell me a little bit about that? 
Yeah, so we actually did an open evening event talking to year three and year four students. Uh, we showed them the car, we ran it along a track. We also did a year seven assembly and like the year seven's really interested in joining and wanted to know how to start F1 in schools, so yeah. Well, that looks absolutely amazing. This whole thing is absolutely jam-packed with information and sponsors, so who wants to give them a little bit of shout out? Yeah, Will. Yeah, yeah. Uh, our sponsors have really helped us get to this uh, get to this stage of the competition, and we'd really like to thank them all for the support. Well, I think they'll be thankful for the airtime we got them there. So I'm just going to jump on to the next team, which is Ion Racing. How are we feeling? Excited about today? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So this pit display looks absolutely incredible. Lots of screens there. Lots lots of information. What's what's on those screens? Um, so on this one, we've got our portfolios, and on the other one, we've got a assembly of the car. We've just got team members dodging our cameraman there to show us all the important work. Um, lots of lots of trophies here. Is this your first year in the competition? No, it's our second, I think. No, 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 no. For Nationals, sorry, this is our first. First time at the Nationals. How are you enjoying the event? It's really fun. Very nerve-wracking, though. I can imagine. Uh, lots of sponsors on this board. Anyone you want to thank in particular? Uh, well, my mum owns the Old House Tea Rooms, and obviously Magna, they produce the T-shirts, so that's great. They're also our biggest sponsor. I've got to say, these T-shirts are looking incredible, so great job to Magna for doing that. I'm going to jump onto the next team. Thank you for having me, everyone. And hello, we have the Bond Panthers. How are you doing today? I'm good, thank you. How are so, you? There's a lot of, oh, thank you, I'm well. There's a lot of information on this pit display. I love the, the car development, so why do you think it's important to show everyone how your cars change through the year? Well, I think it's, I think it's important to show how we develop and how we think to maximise our chances of winning in the competition. Looks absolutely amazing. Are these old? Are these old prototypes we've got here? Um, no, these. Well, this is our entry class car. This is our a national, a regional finals, and in here is our um, national finals. And we're keeping that in the garage for safekeeping. Yes. <clears throat> so, um, these sponsors are looking amazing. Is there anyone you want to thank in particular? Uh, our two primary sponsors are Cosgrove Brown and um, Avato, which, which gave us a huge £1,200. Amazing. And there's lots of lots of little freebies here, so if people in the competition haven't been down to Pomp Bond Panther's car, pit display you should get here now. Thanks for having me, everyone. I'm going to jump over to the next pit display. Oh, there, there is another one, isn't there? Hello. <laughs> And next up, we have Sim Sim Chimera Racing. Chimera. Chimera Racing, I got it wrong again. And we've got the, the broken foot over there. Hope they haven't been making it stand too long. It's not too bad. So, pit display looks absolutely incredible. Thank you very much. I love that revolving plinth. Do you want to tell me a little bit about it? Yes. So, we made it ourselves. We built it entirely, uh, in, uh, sorry, we built it entirely uh, in our department at school. So, yeah, we're very proud of it. I think it's quite impressive. We've got uh, LEDs and uh, strip lights on the bottom as well. So, yes. And I can see you've got a trophy there. Is that be that's best engineered car? Yeah. Uh, that's from regionals. We're really proud to have won that. It's a really wonderful trophy as well. I mean, it looks, it looks amazing. So you got, have you got, you think you've got all the important information I need to know about Chimera Racing on this pit display? Uh, yeah, perhaps the origin of the word uh, Chimera. That's quite important. Malachi, would you like to tell her? Yeah, I'd love to. So it's an ancient Greek uh, creature formed of like different sorts of creatures, like a dragon, a lion, a, a goat, a snake. It, so the idea is that all of these different animals have their own abilities that like come together to form this magnificent like frightening creature yeah it's well absolutely amazing i love the origin thanks for having me and best of luck for results later on today find out where i'm going i'm going to team silverstone utc how are we doing not bad not bad looks absolutely amazing lots of different car iterations there yeah. um who decided what to go on the what's going to go on the pit display yeah so it was all of a collaborative effort we wanted to sort of a representation of all our different job roles out there so we've got bits about the business bits about the um car development side and yeah just sort of getting everything out there i mean i can see one thing that i would like to steal from this pit display and it's that jacket it looks absolutely amazing who wants to tell me about that i mean um it was a jacket that was um, part of our team wear. We, we, we all have them, it's just that it's a, it's a bit too hot recently to be wearing them. Um, so we decided to put one on display. Um, fun fact about it, um, it is made out of 55 plastic bottles, which is amazing for sustainability. It's incredible that that kind of thing is um, possible. So we could go around here, collect 55 bottles and make our own? Maybe, if you can find out how. Looks 
I, I'd have to manufacture it myself. Absolutely amazing. I love that. I love that jacket. I love that enthusiasm. Best of luck for results, guys. Uh, next, we have Velocity Racing. This pit display looks incredible. Very professional. Lots of lots of branding. Big part about the primary sponsors. Do you want to tell me a little bit about that? Uh, so our primary sponsor is Touring Car Experiences. We've worked very closely with them, and they've been a real help to the team. They gave us our biggest sponsorship, and yeah, they're really nice. We've also got Renishaw, Emma Finch uh, Counselling, Cadle Solutions, and One Line as our sponsors. And yeah, they've been a real help for us, and really. I mean, there's so much on this pitch, but I don't know what to pick out. Um, sustainability, especially, um, why do you think that's important in this competition? Definitely, like especially going forward with climate change and all the new stuff around F1, especially the hybrid era and all electric cars. And that's important for like everyone to help out and think about, like especially in like communities like this. I think it's really important, yeah. It looks absolutely amazing. F1 in schools, taking inspiration from the real F1. Thank you for having me, guys. I'm going to go to the next, the next team. Come with me, we're going this way. <laughs> And I think this is our, our uh, not our final team, Team Traction. How are you doing today? Good, thank you. How are you? I'm very good, thank you. And we've got our penguin, remind me of the name? Terence. Terence the penguin. Oh, and you've got some more orange snacks there. Um, there's so much to pick out about this pit display. What do, what do you want to tell me about it? We love, we love the penguin. Everything's penguin themed and it's all orange, so we all stand out. I mean, it looks absolutely incredible. Lots of, lots of little freebies over there. Um, why do you think it's important to have um, things on display at your, at your pit display, like to have things to take away? It's all very interactive, so anyone can come and look at our sponsors. And would you like anything? I'm going to take myself a penguin for after lunch. Um, I see all the car iterations here. So who, who's an engineer on this, this team? I'm going to jump over here with the cameraman. Um, why do you think it's important to share all of your developments? Oh, just to show that we progressed and made the best design that we could to compete today and to also yesterday to get like the best results that we can possible as well. And it just shows that we've learned more and more throughout this competition and in F1 in schools in a total. So. There we go, always developing and always improving. Looks incredible, guys. Um, best of luck for the re results afterwards, and I'll see you soon. And next we're going to have Photon Racing from the Royal Grammar School. Happy with how yesterday went? Uh, I think it went well. I think verbal is our strong point, and we're happy with our time because it's an improvement from regionals. Well, you can show me the skills in verbals, and you can tell me what you think is important about the pit display. Um, I think the, the colours are important as due to research we figured that blue and purple are aesthetically pleasing and the black makes it stand out from the others. And it does look absolutely incredible and you've got some of these avatars that, that are meant to be meant to be you guys? Yeah, um, we, we tried to make avatars, yeah. Um, I think it looked, worked pretty well. I mean, I could tell it was you. Um, what's going on here with the, with the sponsors on the wall? Um, so we've got our ROI over here and um, we've got like a, the little process of us, our sponsorship over here. And um, oh, I, I, I'm not head of sponsorship. You should be asking Peter. Ah. I'll, I'll ask about the screen. Um, what's what's going on here? Why have you got the Why have you got the screen? You think an interactive element? Um, yeah. So part of our plan originally was to create an interactive way. However, due to technical if difficulties, it was like slightly difficult to convey it. Suppose there were a few issues bringing it to the competition and connecting it. So we had to improvise and go for just these two slides. I mean, overcoming these challenges and hopefully this has given you the best shot against the world finals. So best of luck everyone and see you later. I think we have our final team in development class, Kronos Racing. How you doing? Good, thank you. Yeah. So this pit display looks so professional. Oh, look at those caramel bars over there. They look great. Um, and those water bottles, I've got, there's so many things I want to talk about. So you, you tell me your favourite part. Um, our favourite part is definitely our uh, promotional seed bombs. Uh, you plant them in the ground and it grows. And we also have our uh, uh, Instagram tag on them, so you can follow us through that. And that's definitely our best, our best promotional item. I mean, it looks so professional. Is that something that you guys were going for? Or is it just something that's happened by accident? Yeah. Definitely. Like one of the things we want is we could like keep on reusing these boards like in future years of the competition. Uh, just like they all look really nice. We got them like professionally done for us. So they're really great. I mean, it does look absolutely amazing. And I love, is this the progression from model block to the car? Is that what you're trying to show here? Yeah. So that's just where we started. That's all the stuff we added to the car, and then our final car is on top. Well, it looks absolutely incredible. And I think I'm going to go over here to just say thank you. That has been our development class pit walk for today.